teach you how to add new photos to an already existing photo album. I'm going to tell you a couple different ways to do it. It can be a little bit confusing, but I'm going to try to simplify it for you. You go into your page, and this is my page. You see my, my status right now, my picture. And up here you'll see your wall, your information, your photos. And your tabs might be in a little different arrangement than this. But you just go up to photos, click on photos. These are all my mo mobile uploads. Now you'll know I've got an iPhone and I'm constantly uploading for, from that. So it's a, a bit um, disorganized up there. But you go down to the bottom and you'll see Kristen's album. So yours will say, for instance, Darius's album. And you'll go into these albums and you select the one that you want to add the picture to. Let's just say that I want to add a picture to this one. I've got lots of albums in here, but I'm just going to select this. And you're going to see right here, um, it says right in here at this album, this album is just simply titled June 14th, 2009 because I didn't name it anything. It was just a cartoon. So I can go in here and say add more photos. As soon as you click on this, you're not going to see that. You're going to be able to edit the photo, and you can do that from, from the photo itself. So tag this photo, edit this photo, delete this photo. But let's go back to the album here. And then you go right here, and now it says right up here, organize photos, so you can make one, if you had more than one, you can make one the initial photo that everybody will see, or you can um, do other things, add captions. Now I'm going to say add more photos, and this is what's going to come up. I'm using Firefox on this, but all this, the browsers should be fairly, um, fairly similar. So it's going to bring up my desktop, and it's going to allow me to pick, some, to pick anything else of all my images. Let's just say that I want to add this image, or you want to go into different places on your computer, and it's going to load files. So, you, so it's just like anything else where you find your, your images on your, on your desktop. And let's see, let's let it go back to here. I'm just going to select this like that. You can select more than one. You can select two. You can rotate it if you wish. backwards, upside down, to see what happens there. I'm going to select this one. And then just so, so I'm going to select three of these just for the heck of it. And then I'm, you could select them all. You can deselect the ones that I just selected, and then you can upload. So I'm going to click Upload, and you can see it's uploading. So we'll give it a second to do that. So it seems a, it seems a little complicated just as to where to find that. When you click on the image itself, you won't have that opportunity to upload, but when you click on the album, the actual album, then you can see that things are being uploaded. So this is just going to take a second here. And then once this is done uploading, I'm going to show you a way to upload a photo that's already in your Facebook pictures. So this is a way to add new pictures to this particular album. And then I'm going to show you a way to, if you already have a picture on there, let's say from your mobile photos, and you want to add it to an existing album. Okay, so I, what I did was I, I canceled that upload because it was taking too long, and I wanted to get back on with the tutorial. So I'm going to splice these two tutorials together. Anyway, what would have happened is I would have had those three extra pictures along with this one in this album. This album we called June 14, 2009, so it's not all that original, but... Now I want to show you how to take pictures that are already on your Facebook um, pictures and put them into this album. So take whatever existing pictures you have, as long as you uploaded them. The thing to note is that if somebody else uploaded or tagged you in a picture and it appears on your mobile uploads, you will not be able to put that into an album because it's not yours. So as long as you uploaded the picture, you can do it. So let's go back to my pictures. I'm going to go back to my photos. If you ever get lost and can't figure out how to get back into your pictures, just simply go to your profile up here and then just go back into photos. When you're in photos here, you've got that same thing. You can go back to your wall where we just came from and then back to your photos. So just a simple way to, but if you get lost, just go up here and go to profile and you'll be able to find your pictures again. So uh, up on here in the mobile view photos of Kristen, I've got a lot of pictures here that other people tag me in. So they're pictures that I didn't upload. And if I didn't upload them, I'm not going to be able to stick them into that album that we want to stick it into. Okay, so we've seen how you can't 
take somebody a picture that you were tagged in that somebody else took and it happens to be on your page and you can't take that and put it into your album. But you can take a picture that you uploaded. So I uploaded this picture, it's just from my mobile phone, but let's just say I want to put it in that album that we had in the very beginning. So what we do is we take this picture and we scroll down, if I, if I can possibly get this to scroll. Hmm, there we go. And you get down to this place right here. Now, you'll notice that on any other person's um, photo, you'll see tag this photo. You won't see edit this photo unless it's one of your photos. So you uploaded it, you can edit it. If you didn't upload it and you're tagged in a picture, you can't edit it. That also means you cannot put it into an album. But this picture I did upload, so I can click edit this photo. So I want to put this picture into that other album. All you have to do is go under here and say move to and let's see I think it was I think that was no it wasn't June 14th see I already forgot what it was called um, <laughs> maybe it was June 14th 2009 I think it was let's just move it to that album but you can move it to whatever album you want so if you've got a couple albums or many albums you can move your pictures to whichever ones you want so let's put it in there I'm going to say save changes and now you're going to see that if I go back to the album I should see both pictures in there, and I do. So um, that was that June 14, 2009, I added this picture. So if I had allowed that upload to occur from my hard drive, you'd see those other three pictures that I was uploading and this one. Those I uploaded from my hard drive. This one I uploaded just from pictures I already had on Facebook. So that's how you can maneuver, um, edit your pictures, and change them, put them into albums.